Welcome, welcome to Chuggy Chogs Let's Play Dungeons and Dragons Online. Let's see, our next quest is Red Fang the Unruled. But before we get to that, I wanted to do a dice roll. Big money, big money. Ah, uh, <laughs> hey, mnemonic elixirs. This might come in handy later on. Sure, why not? I might start banking some of those because I don't want to level too quickly. <clears throat> All right, so Red Fang the Unruled on normal. Alrighty, we have a couple minutes left, maybe, on this guy. Ow! Two minutes left. Let's get him in. Gromis, where are you? <laughs> Sit back and relax, boss. I'll take care of this dungeon for you. <laughs> Alright, well, let's double check my clickies and all that stuff, and we're good. Get this. We're going to leave him parked here and on, not on the attack mode for a minute. It's always good to look behind you when you enter in a quest just to make sure there aren't any barrels like that one there. Sneaky barrels. They're always sneaking up behind me. No, barrel. Leave me alone. I, I gave at the office. <laughs> uh oh, I'm spotting danger. This quest has a few, uh, a few good traps in it. Oh, spotting any more danger. I'm hearing danger too. Ah, no. Leave me alone. Oh, it lagged up. Oh, you got poison. You got poison at home. I don't want your poison. <laughs> We're running around circles here. Oh. That was weird though, the initial attack it made, it like, when it tried to leap on me, it like lagged out. Yeah, so that just a tad more, I guess. Yeah, he's back gone. Hmm. Oh, yeah. Oh yeah. I'm like running quest on normal. Designated and corpses line the walls <laughs> and hang from the ceiling. Dead assistants or failed adventurers. Oh no. Yeah, this is my probably my favorite DM's voice in this quest here. I think the server is like much laggier than my own server. I don't remember it being like this. I was waiting. I shot this one and then I turned over here and about three seconds later that one went down. Wow. Yeah, it's a little laggy, I'd say. Just a little bit. Darn bio lag monster! Gromus here. You ready, Gromus? Just me at the door for you. Yeah, Gromus. <clears throat> I think I'll turn him off again for a minute. <laughs> Mm-hmm. 
mainly want to get these egg sacks. There's spawn button. Crystal spiders or wherever they are. Oh, get the spider! <laughs> All right, let's turn him on. Get him. There we go. He's he's on kill mode now. This is retreat. Signal crystals Ooh. rest on either side of the metal door. Uh oh. Ah. Oh, darn it. Ooh, file spider. Play that combat music. Yeah, sure, a lot of crates in here, yes. <laughs> Ooh, resist fire. Give a real quick look over, make sure we got everything. Oh, oh no, some silver there. Alright. Oh boy. I have feather fall, but platforms line looking. the rim of a deep shaft descending into the unknown. Whoa, you evil spider! Hey man! <laughs> Actually, I hit him for uh, 21 in there, like 19 and 2. I think that was me. So he came up with a sneak attack with that 2 points. <laughs> it's crazy not having Feather Fall. Ooh, crit. I rolled a crit. Did that deception actually work? It must have. That's cool. I love how he just teleports to me. Like, doo -doo -doo, teleport. Actually, I need him to stay good for a minute. There. All right. I'll lead this stuff back up to him. I want to. There's a lot of traps in this quest. So I just want to make sure he doesn't trigger all those. Well, hopefully he won't. Ooh, I heard something fall out of that one. I'll have to check that out in a minute. Oh. 
you mean I can't hit that? I'm trying to shoot it. No. It's too far away, I guess. Or is it being? It's probably being obstructed by the wall more than anything. Oh, I heard that. There's a creepy crawly around here. Sounds like it's going to come above. <clears throat> ah, another good roll. Another good roll. A dangerous looking spider crawls in the shadows, hungry for a meal. Venom becomes still <laughs> as you end its life. Oh, where do you think you're going? No, 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 no. You stay right there, mister. Yeah, don't, don't do anything. Just stay put. Like, there's still another trap somewhere around here. I want to I wanna loot this... Uh, here and then what were we wearing for a belt again? Oh, false life belt. See, and this is a plus two item. So and this here, uh the quest giver outside the entrance of this quest will give us something in exchange for that. Probably nothing fancy, but it's you know, it's worth it to check. Haha. I was picking up another detect over here, I thought. There it is. There's a bunch of spike traps, I think. That's not very comforting to know that I'm not detect I'm detecting some things and not able to spot it when I do my search, I guess. Let's get another good search here. Able. Ooh! <laughs> I rolled a one on that. No way. See, just, there's just different. Uh, I like that. The, I like that. Though. I like that. There's different uh, difficulties for um, you know the difficulty checks for for different traps in in quests. This is a level three quest. And I roll a one, and I'm able to disable the device. And you know, my disable device was maybe a tad lower at the. Kirk's got a secret, but not much lower. But I'm still... That one's still eating me. That one... That panel that blew up. It's like, ah, oh, man. You know. <laughs> My perfect streak. <laughs> Alright, so we have this open. This door will stay open, which is good. Only problem is... That... Well, we'll leave him up here, I think. But the problem is, is that I only can go down here. I don't think I can get back up. Is what I'm trying to say. Once you get down the uh, the shaft here, the hole, or in this pit here, or whatever it's called, uh, you will have to. 
Uh, I mean, you can jump off this ladder and back, but <laughs> not having feather fall is kind of hard to do. I'll just cast feather fall on just in case, but and you have to also jump off that ladder, like over. You know, it's kind of it's just difficult to do. I have done it before, but you know, I had jump and a few other things. And I do have a jump potion. I guess I technically had to get rid of the way, but, but I haven't had a need for the shrine other than to get my clicky back, so I'm not going to really use it. Wow, I see that creepy spider mm -hmm. shadow there. Oh yeah, got my body feeder. Oh yeah. Now we were detecting something up here. That is just creepy. There it is. somebody break a breakable it wasn't me oh look it's shooting its range and it's got a lob so it's hitting the ceiling oh it still hit me though that's not fair I guess I can bring our buddy down now. It's like I'm... Yeah, and he always does that. I bring him in and he does 103, 108, you know, whatever. It's like super big crits. This is crazy. A deadly looking scorpion crawls forward to challenge you. Where? Uh, I, I do not see this dead looking scorpion. A signal crystal is set in the wall. Perhaps it is tied to a door somewhere. A door, huh? Normally I climb up here, I think, you know, because I'm trying to get the, the crystal um, skeleton eggs. Uh, but I'll need to this time, I guess. Alright, let's put him on don't do anything mode again. And we've got one of these left. Uh oh. Detecting a trap. Though there appears to be a way through the sphinx, the high ground seems safer. Yeah, it only shuts off some of the spikes, though. Whoa! <laughs> That's the lag, it's ridiculous. 
I mean, I, I just kind of slid off there, and then it kind of lagged me. Right after that. in here so we'll search here and we're doing a quick Q spam here as well <clears throat> yeah, we'll go back to that room in a second there's this room over here needs to be done first I love trying to trip a spider. It's like eight legged animal is going to be hard to trip. Well, I guess they're vermin. They're like critters more than they are animals. They're more like uh, insectoids. I guess. Still an animal though. Unless it's not a, it's a lesser animal, I guess. Even if it is as big as I am or bigger. Again, we got that. So that's two levers we uh, we pulled, and now we run over here. Oh, spot in danger. A lot of danger. Woo! That is not good stuff there. Turned off. There's a bunch of those in here, though. Uh oh. Oh no! Strength damage. Oh. I wasn't trying to go that direction. <laughs> I'm just trying to avoid the critters. Alright. I have something for that. Well, that's running. Let's see if we can't get the rest of these trap panels. Actually, let's leave that shut. That'll keep them from coming in. Oh, I can't quite make it up. Oh. <laughs> I'm getting some like little lag spikes from moving around like oh, this is not good. Now we gotta run and grab that ledge there. Uh, there we are. Oh, 
I'd probably should use one of these starter potions just to top off a little bit. Besides, it'll free up inventory slot eventually. <laughs> they keep using them. Alright, looks like we got everything cleared out. Oh, I did see one of these still on. Hmm. I'm not hearing it though, I'm just seeing it. Alright. Oops, that's the wrong weapon set. Alright, now we can turn Gromis loose again. Get him, Gromis! Kill it! Kill the widow! I guess it's a more of a she than it is a he. It was a widow, right? But I guess, like, I don't know. <laughs> I guess there are black widow spiders and there'd be two different genders, or there wouldn't be black widow spiders as a species. So. But that must be a it must be a sucky thing for the, the the male spider to be called a black widow. It's like I'm not a widow. Widower maybe, but <laughs> oh, I can't hit that one. Things I've never really thought about before. <laughs> oh, okay, we got a little bit of loot, a little bit of loot. Where'd old Gromus go? He just kinda decided to hop over there and stay over there. Quick Q spams, make sure I'm not missing anything. Oh, I heard that. Did you hear that, Gromus? One leather armor of axe block. I wonder if that's better than what we're wearing. Ours is better for armor class. It's a plus two. But axe block gives you a DR pierce bludgeon, which is it would uh, I don't know, it would it's four slash bludgeon except for I don't know if that two DR is worth it or the armor class is worth it. That's kind of a toughie. It's like, you well, know, the DR would be good, except, you know, now I'm starting to get hit by things that do more than like one point of damage or two points of damage. So I don't know. Oh, oh, the, did I kill it? Did I get the kill? Ah, I killed him, Gromis. <laughs> Combat log says it, so that's proof. And this is a video. I got video screenshot proof of it, buddy. <laughs> I killed it. You did not get the steal this time. I got the kill steal. Oh wait, you, Mister. I'm gonna turn you off again here, so I can. The cobwebs here are thicker, as if a more yeah. potent silk were being spun by the spiders. Red Fang must be near. Should we search for the trap first? That uh, we saw the trap panel, but uh, the trap up ahead. Now this is actually a really good trap, and it's almost worth avoiding the trap to go get. On elite difficulties, I often avoid the trap to go get the spiders and then bring them back up into the trap. Um, there are a couple spiders down there, and uh, a few other critters too, but. There's another trap up here. Let's switch my goggles back here.
Oh, it fell into the graphics. I can't get it. No, oh, I need every penny I can get. <laughs> Oh, something else fell. What kinds of goodies are falling out of barrels tonight? Uh, spider. Spider! trying to shoot the bow and sometimes it's just not doing anything. And it's not registering as a miss or a hit, it's just you know it's doing the animation and nothing's happening. Ooh, dexterity boots. That's probably better than what I'm wearing. We'll leave these on for a moment. I'm probably gonna wear those. So I got another trap here. And we'll do deal with that first. Well, hold on. Getting some good rolls here. Ah, I'm detecting a secret ore. I think we can bring in our buddy now. Uh-oh. Uh-oh. Ah, it's a troll! It's a troll! What's in here, Gramas? Oh, Gramas is like, oh, I'll take that. Uh, actually, what you're wielding is better. That's a force damage. That's why it's that purpley color. It's a better weapon than one that. Uh, eh, eh. <laughs> I did that. Eh, eh. I think this quest ends when you pick up the the poison fang from Red Fang. At least I hope that's the case. Like you get the poison gland, I think, is proof that you killed it. We'll hope that's the case. It's been a while, like I said. Yeah, see you have to pick up the gland, so we'll avoid the glands. Chittering noises of alarm rise around you as you breach the heart of Red Fang's lair. So that way we can get the, make sure we get the ransack. So I've been thinking like the next few quests what to run, there's a lot of uh, chains that start to pop up in this at this level. One of them is the catacombs chain. I'd like to run that. And then um there's something else here now. Uh and then there's the waterworks, which is another good one. Uh and then we also start the Tangle Root Gorge chain at this level, so or at least that's what's coming up for us. Uh, so I'm kind of thinking what I'll do is um, I'll run all the single quests like Red Fang and Sacred Helm and a few other quests are at this level and then we'll and then once we're done that we'll work on uh, 
you know, the, there's just like five single quests that aren't chain related. We'll get those done. Look at Dwarven Axe. This guy's getting all the loot for his hireling. It's like, ah, uh, there you go, Gromisk. Have fun with all that loot I just got that you certainly would use better than myself. Um, all right, so we'll go ahead and finish out. XP we getting? Oh, we get some decent XP for this, right? All right, time to go. Thanks, Gromisk. All right, Basil Talbro. <clears throat> yes, I did slew the beast. I, I, I slew it quite well. <laughs> I found this uh, large spider had sold uh, a swollen poison sack, and you get a potion of cat's grace. I also found the stinger, and you're most welcome. Ooh, tales of valor. It's basically no different than that leather we found downstairs. That's a nice great axe, though. Wow, shocking burst. So that does 1 to 6 electrical damage on every hit. And then it crits for even more damage. Um, so that's that's pretty awesome. If I was using a two-handed weapon, that would be a nice one to use. And Chainmail Shirt of Death Block. Again, we don't really need Death Block at this level. Not, y not yet, at least. It does affect negative energy, but it's mainly we're looking at the, the magical effects that cause instant death. And right now... We're not. We're not gonna see that in probably for at least another two levels or so. So uh, at least not that I can, what I remember <laughs> as far as stuff will come across. So that's a really nice axe. It's a shame to pass it up, but there is tales of valor in here, so we're gonna take that. All right. Well, we'll re reset this, and uh, we'll head on to some other quests. But until next time, um, thanks for watching.